Hey, what's up you guys? It is an amazing Friday and I am super stoked. I have had a fun week. Um, I got to go on to ABC for Good Things Utah yesterday and it was such a fun experience to be able to go on there and promote my cake creation studio, my do-it-yourself cake and cupcake decorating studio here in Provo. It was so amazing. And I wanna talk about the reason why I had the opportunity in the first place. So Stephanie um, from Gatehouse, um, which is a, a local company here in Utah County, um, and they are incredible. They, I have teamed up with them for the last, I think four years, if not five, um, on a local um, kind of outreach event that they do every year that is called um, like uh, Love's Local. And what they do every year is they try to bring together local businesses and, tr and help support them and help um, be able to bring in that kind of local community and they've been doing it so consistently and um, I've always been involved like I said for the last four or five years and I've made a couple really cool cakes for them I've made that chair cake for them I'll try to pop a picture in here of that while I'm talking here working with them has been such a pleasure um, Stephanie reached out to me a few weeks ago and asked if I would be interested in going on um, Good Things Utah um, and that she had um, secured a spot for the next year to um, help support local businesses and help um, show support and provide an opportunity for them to talk about their business on the news. And I was blown away, I'm really touched by it and really excited. Um, it um, just goes to show those networking relationships, those business relationships, um, are so important to keep up. Um, and also, not just from a personal standpoint, but just from an overall being able to help each other standpoint. I mean, if you look at it, um, she has been very instrumental in helping a lot of businesses um, here in Utah County. And it's not just for her personal gain, but it's just, it, but she is trying to really truly support other businesses and it's just been amazing so stephanie if you're watching or if you ever watch this or if you never watch this um thank you you're awesome gatehouse is incredible um I, i'm just kind of blown away by it still even though it already happened yesterday so i'm really appreciative of that um and with that as a reminder um go support local wherever you are whether you're in Utah or another state or in another country, go and support your local businesses. I think that's something that all of us can do better on. Um, it's so easy to go to the big box stores and the huge chains and everything and spend money. But when we actually shop local companies, you're actually helping families in your local community that are trying to make it and trying to provide value to the world. And I think that's huge. I think it's a huge, huge, huge thing. And I've appreciated it. Uh, it's the only reason I've you know, made it through 2020 in my business is that people have supported me. Um, and some months were really, really tight and almost thought I was gonna have to close um, quite a few times this last year. Um, but I'm still here um, and we keep, we keep, keep on going. Um, so we're really excited. Um, so really excited for next steps. Um, our next couple weeks are super busy here at the studio. We have a lot of reservations coming in um, for Valentine's Day and super, super excited about that. I um, hope that everything continues to move up after Valentine's Day, but we'll see what happens. Um, kind of depends on how um, COVID decides to, you know, how everybody decides to deal with COVID and what's going on with cases and all that kind of stuff. So um, we'll see, but I'm hopeful. I'm very hopeful and very optimistic for this year um, and a few other projects I have going on um, that, you know, things are gonna be good. I think things are gonna be working out okay. Um, but that's something important that I've had to remind myself through the year um, 2020 and still every single day is just offer up my self perspective um, and self-awareness as well. Um, and perspective, I mean 
just being able to look at it um, from a different perspective, as in like things like COVID, things like other people in general, um, though what other people do and what happens through COVID and those kind of things, those are all things out of our control. Those circumstances are things that we can't do anything about. And um, it's really, it comes down to our thinking on the, what I mean by perspective is I mean, being able to see that things like COVID, um, things like challenges that you have in your business, um, most of those are external and like external circumstances that you don't have control over. And so what, and then also what I mean by self-awareness is realize that like you're the one that gets to make the decisions in your business. And um, being self-aware so that you're not beating yourself up that you had a bad month in business and being you know, down in the dumps because things went horrible for you um, because of COVID and then making that mean something about yourself or something and then getting in depressed, getting depressed or whatever it may be. Um, but know that you have the power within yourself to make a choice to be able to deal with the circumstance and um, deal with um, what's going on. And because if you if you look at it, you know, from a sad or depressed standpoint or mad or angry, you're likely just gonna spiral to a place of negativity and you're not gonna go anywhere. Um, but if you can shift how you're thinking about things um, and shift thinking that, you know, well, what's the positive thing out of this? Or what's something that I can do instead of sitting here being sad? Um, anyway, I just wanted to share some of those thoughts, but I hope all of you are doing really well. Um, this year is, I think, going to be amazing, and I believe it can be amazing, and I'm just gonna kind of continue um, operating under that um, optimism, optimism that things are going to be great. Hope you all have a good week. I'm excited for this weekend to be able to spend some time with my family and being able to reconnect with them a little bit after being so busy this week. Um, remember also, reconnect with those that you love. Make sure that you are spending you know, the time necessary to, um, even if it's a few moments, just to tell those in your life that you love them. And whether that's a spouse or a friend or a brother or sister or a daughter or a son or a grandparent, whoever it may be, reach out to somebody. Just tell them you care. Tell them you love them. Smile at a stranger. Just do something kind. Doing those acts of kindness and being positive and thinking um, outside yourself a little bit and thinking of others um, really um, helps a lot. Um, I think it brings a lot of um, joy and a lot of positivity. Uh, love you guys. You are all awesome. And hope you have a wonderful week. All right. Pete Tidwell with The Mighty Baker. And we're peacing out. Until next week. We'll see ya.